Hi, I'm uh, Calvin Lauritsen. Uh, today we're 15 minutes out of Palmerston North at Kairanga, halfway between Palmerston North and Fielding. We're milking 400 cows at peak. They're Frisian, Frisian cross cows. System 3 farm, and it's a nice little herd. We've had the herd all the way through since our sheep milking days in the um, Waikato. Went from management to 50-50 up there, and then came back and brought into the family farm. So yeah, farming's sort of been in the blood on both sides of our family for generations. We run the VAC Plus square liners. Those ones I've used ever since I've come on this farm, so for the last six years. I didn't use them in the Waikato, um, but I went to them when I came down here and I wouldn't change. Since I've been on this farm for six years, we've just had teat cracks, which you'd expect in winter, which heal pretty quick, but I haven't had one sort on the end of a teat. Um, our heifers don't kick cups off. Um, part of that's probably breeding or that we handle them a lot, but also part of that is definitely the comfort of the fact that they've got that extra like air around the teat with the square liner, rather than just sucking on it with the round one. So, for us in our system, we wouldn't change from, and we haven't changed from for the last six years. So in terms of maintenance, our rubberware is under constant review. We do the monthly shed checks on rubberware, where everything's checked. Things like airlines are checked and replaced as needed, um, and everything else is pretty much in line with the recommendations from Scatter Up. So we replace droppers and elbows yearly, and then our liners are replaced twice a year. So keep that in, uh, in line with what's recommended and can't go wrong. It's great to have that service where you can like call someone if you have a problem, if for some reason there's a problem, so grading someone else to come and cast an eye over it, an expert, see where the problem is, or even just run the eye over the shed and just see what rubber is coming up for replacement. We have a plan we stick to, but it can change, like if something changes like you were to grade or, or something popped up, it's good to have that backup, a second opinion.